Okay, all right, here we go. Let's see. Now, uh, if you look at number one right off the bat, you will see that I am going to have you multiply fractions, okay, to find the area of a triangle. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna write it out without saying anything and then uh, we'll go from there. Okay, so there you go, all right. So uh, leave it in the improper fraction form. Okay, number two, now you're gonna see this. I'm gonna tell you now, you're gonna see one question like this where I'm asking you if you know what a quadrilateral is, all right? Hopefully you'll pick this, all right? Four-sided shape, right? This one, let's see. Now, uh, I'm going to go ahead and use my calculator. Okay, so by the way, so on the, on the original question of this question here in the database, it gave you the formula for the area of a trapezoid. And then I had to double check. And the state said that the, um, what, what did the state say? The state said that your you are not allowed the formula, okay, for a trapezoid. So I'm going to follow the lead and not give you the area formula for a trapezoid. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and do the question. 20 plus 6 is 26 times 8 is 208 divided by 2 is 104, okay? All right. Next. All right, let's see. Same thing. All right, 8 plus 11 is 19 times 4. By the way, this 5 here, not useful, okay? Doesn't help you at all, so do not use that. But by 2, that's 38. Last question, all right? A new house was built in the lot, right? Now, that's a trapezoid, right? Tells you it's a trapezoid, first of all. Second, base 1, base 2, that's the height, okay? So don't get thrown off by that. Don't use the don't use the incorrect numbers. So let me see. 225, right? Plus 325. Yeah. Times. Now you, you really should use a calculator for this. All right. That divided by two is 20,625. Okay. All right. That's it. Thanks for watching. And have a good day. Bye bye. OMG, that was so good.